Tell a friend to tell a friend that do it all hold us in. And we're back with another NBA 2K25 next gen build video. And today I have a special two way pass first big for you guys that will be able to get Hall of Fame break starter. Okay? Now you can change that if you want to. Now, if you want to take the passing up a little bit more and put your plus five on the pass, and that will take this build to another level, but that's totally up to you you feel me so make sure you guys watch the video to the end so i can show you how i create this masterpiece choose the hand of your choice and the jersey number of your choice let's get it man as you can see we are going with the center position if you've been watching my channel man you know that when i create bills i like to create the bills with the maximum um amount of attributes you know what i'm saying so a seven foot center gives you like the top tier attributes you know what i'm saying like 7 1 is cool don't get me wrong uh 6 11 is cool 6 10 you go on down you know it, it depends on you know what you're trying to do because once you go down on the height you know you require other things you feel what i'm saying when you got a seven footer you don't require as much as you would with a six seven six eight six nine bill or even 16 you feel me so um the seven footers are versatile this year and i have one myself and it's one of my favorite bills hand down okay um 241 on the weight 75 wingspan i did the wingspan like that just in case you want to take your three-point shot up with your plus five that's up to you but it will change the name of the bill if you do that so um we're going to leave it right there you can max it out if you want to but that's up to you now with the finishing i wanted to finish in a lot higher but um they were going to change the name of the bill um, when you're playing with a center, you know, you want to have close shots. You want to have standing dunk. If you like post control, you can have a little bit of that. But um, the close shot on this build did not go up as high as I would like, um, but it did go up to a 73. Like I said, we don't want to change the name of the build, so we're going to leave it right there. As far as the post control, we can't take that up too high because it will change the name of the build. So we're going to leave it at around a 77, which is not all that bad. You have some post going on the build, so you can get in the post and do a move depending on the defender. So um, it's up to you. You on if you want to take it up and change the name of the build standing dunk y'all know i would love to get this to a 90 but once again it does change the name of the build at 90 so i left it at 85 you get an extra set of standing dunk animations at 85 but you do get pro big man contact dunks with this build so no need to worry about that as far as the driving dunk all we need is a 73 okay don't take it to no 60 something and miss out on poster rather we ain't on that type of time man a lot of people do that no don't do that um, put your poster riser on bronze, right? Then your max plus one, go to silver. Simple as that. So that's what we got for the finishing. Let's go to the physicals. Uh, we're gonna take that speed up to a 70. We're gonna get that um, agility up to a 55. Strength, y'all know, 91 strength, man. 91, 91, 91. Anything above that is just icing over the cake. But if you go out there with a center, okay, you can have high interior defense and you got low strength, you're gonna get bullied by me, okay? You, you, you can take it to an 80-something. I have not seen centers with, you know, uh, 80, 83 strength. Here I am with a 91. You're not going to be able to stop me, okay? I'm just going to put it like that. Um, as far as the vertical, we're going to get that vertical up to 83. Vertical is very important this year. So we got that. Uh, we got some silver badges when it comes to post scoring, post powerhouse, post up poet, uh, rise up, you know, um, area wizard. We got that on goal. Uh, like I said, the only thing I don't like is the close shot. I want that higher, but, you know, it is what it is. Let's go ahead and get to the green bean. Make your girl scream badge. Now, to get this build name, you need a 76 three-point shot. Like, taking it up higher than that will change the name of the build. It's unfortunate, but that's just the way it is. Even with the mid-range, taking the mid-range up too high will change the name of the build. So, uh, we can't get it to a 78, but we will take it to a 77, and that does give us um, that does give us um, uh, um, the same name. Okay, so 77 mid range shot should be to make some middies. Uh, 76 three. I'm not saying you can make threes, but there are some people out there that can. I think I can make it work, but a lot of people can't make it work, and you know people struggle to shoot this year. So if this is not for you, it's not for you. Okay, we want a certain name, so we have to do certain things, and that's just what it is. Me personally, I would like to take it to a 79 or take the mid range up higher, but that's just not what 2K is letting me do with this build. So I hope you understand. But let's go ahead and get it to the sauce. But before we do, I need you guys to do me a huge favor, right? Go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, and let the video play to the end because that will push the video to the recommended page so everybody mom can see this video. And I need everybody mom to see the video, so do that for your boy, boy. Now, as far as the pass action, like I told you guys in the intro, that we are going to take it to a 93, right? So a 93 is going to give us Hall of Fame break starter. Now, 
if you want legend break starter it's a 98 so all you need is your plus five and that'll get you um legend um break starter okay or you could go let's see let's see let's see what, what we take up so 99 now if you want 99 passing on this bill take your um pass accuracy to a 94 then take your plus five and put your plus five on the pass and look at those badges man legend bell out legend break star legend versatile visionary legend timer like that would be crazy for a center you know but we're not going to go that route now if you want to put the put the plus five right there all you have to do is take it to a 94 i got it at 93 already so if you find a way to get well you can take the mid range down and um take your pass into a 94 and take your plus five and put it right there it's up to you but we got it at 93 i think that's good enough hall of fame break starter right as far as the ball handle we're just going to do a 60 we don't need too much on the um on the ball handle um we still want to keep Jokic in the shades up so he required a little ball handle a little speed with ball so that's what we got for this build now let's go ahead and get to the defense now as a center you want to be able to block shots you want to be able to protect the paint you want to be able to slow people down on the perimeter at times um you know so with this build i made sure you had that interior defense at an 82. now for me playing a 82 interior defense matched with that 91 strength is a good combination now i want to make a build with an 88 uh interior and like a 95 po or 95 strength you know to kind of see the difference you know what i'm saying because i know what the 82 and the 91 could do i want to see what the 88 and 95 could do but that's just me um and i will be creating different builds throughout the year to test things out you know on my own um as you can see we do have that 82 interior so post lockdown is on silver um as far as the shot blocking all i've really been using is the 88 block man i block hella shots with this high flying denier on gold is good paint patrol on silver is good Pogo that's going to be on Hall of Fame. I jump good. Um, I block a lot of shots with an 88. Now, you can take it up higher if you want to. Not saying you need that, but some people do. If you need more shot blocking, take your shot blocking up. Simple as that. If you need more shooting, take your shooting up. If you need more anything, just take it up, man. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to do what I'm doing. You know, I'm just giving you a blueprint to take this and take down, take up what you don't like and what you do like, leave it the same. You know what I'm saying? It's up to you. Now, as far as the perimeter defense, I have a seven foot center with a 62 perimeter. It does help me out a whole lot. I'm not gonna lie, man, that move but force it does help me out now. But if you don't wanna have it, then don't put it on your bill. You know what I'm saying? Not it's not a must have, but it's a plus if you got it. You feel me? So I leave that up to you guys on what you want to do with that. Now as far as the rebound, we're gonna do a 96 on the defense and a 71 on the offense. Hall of Fame box, pogo, rebound chaser. Now if you want legend. You already know, take your plus and put it on, on, on rebound. And I was going to do that, but, you know, it is what it is, all right? Uh, that's what we got for this build. Let's get into the shades of, are you ready? Because guess what? I do not clickbait. Here we go, here we go, here we go now. We do have shades of Sabonis. We got Joey Ellen B. We got Jokic. Uh, some, some pretty good centers right there. I like the comparisons. And the build is the infamous two-way pass first big. That's the build. I'm out of here. Charge!